Podcast. Why does the moon wax and wane? Quacky has made a new friend recently. It is round and bright. A few days later, Quacky comes to look for the moon again. Moon, moon, here I come! My moon is round and chubby. Quacky, connect them in order. I'm sorry, little cat. The moon was not. A few more days later, Quacky goes. Quacky comes. Quacky starts. In a few days, Quacky decides to ask Kiki. In fact, the moon does not shine itself. The moon's light is the reflection of the sun. Kids, put the sun on the board. Then put the Earth on the board. Finally, put the Moon on the board. Look, the Moon is a planet. It moves around the Earth we live on. Turn the gear. The Moon turns to different positions. When we look, the Moon is illuminated by the Sun in different areas. So the moon we see is also different. Look! Sometimes the moon looks round. Sometimes it looks like a semicircle. And sometimes it's a crescent moon. Then when will the moon become round again? When the moon finishes a cycle, you will be able to see the full moon again. I get it! Quacky finally understood why the moon waxes and wanes. Lesson completed. Kids, when it's dark, you can go with your parents to observe the moon. Mom and Dad, check it out. Small picture book! Great big world! Read the picture book with Kiki and Quacky! Boulder Moving Mystery! Put the sticker in the correspond. Ancient Egyptian Pharaoh wanted to build a huge pyramid! To build this pyramid, many, many stones were needed. These stones were big and heavy. How do we move the boulders when they are so heavy? Only strong young men could move them. It's too heavy for three people to pull. Everyone, come and help! Finally! Five people can pull them! So many people pulled together, but it was still a lot of work! It's so hard! Is there a more energy efficient way? Look! Someone had a great idea! Huh? Round logs? They put the round logs underneath the boulders! The round logs rolled, and the boulders moved on top! This method of moving was much easier! Wow! What a great idea! The Egyptians used this method to carry many, many boulders! After many years of moving, the Great Pyramid of Giza was finally completed! The Great Pyramid of Giza is the most magnificent pyramid. It is almost 40 stories high. Finish reading the picture book story. See you next time.